Hey everyone, it's an aging zombie here. In today's video, I'm going to be completing the main Easter egg for Terminus Island. Now, the first thing that needs to happen is the power needs to be turned on. In this part, I don't necessarily know if it's technically a part of the Easter egg, considering it is guided. So, I'm going to get the power turned on, and then I will start going over the steps for how to complete the main Easter egg. Alright. Got the power on, so we're going to raise the lift here. I'm also going to pack a bunch, and then the first thing I need is... I do need the Wonder Weapon for this map, so I need the Beam Smasher. And I know there's a couple ways you can go about doing it. I'm going to go the crafting route. So I've already got dead wire, and I do have a video on my channel that goes over all the steps. Oh, I don't have enough. Hey! Um, I do have a video on my channel going over all the steps to actually get it, so... In this video, I'll probably go just go quickly through it, but the first thing I'm going to need is some essence. Alright, now that I have enough essence to raise this, let's do that. Alright, so we're going to get the last two electrical boxes here. Kill you. Grab the EMF fob. And on the way to interact with the laptops, I'm going to grab the other two items that I need. Actually, let me also upgrade that. Grab this. I wonder if they're ever going to change that because they spawn in a line. <laughs> it's pretty easy to take them out. Alright. First laptop. Second laptop. Third laptop. And now let's go interact with the computer and do some math. Okay. It wants numbers. Now what? Okay, so we've got for this one, X is eleven. Y is going to be 20. And C or Z is going to be 21. Which should give us 33, 57, and 30. I fucking hate puzzles. Or not. <laughs> Alright, what did I mess up on? Okay, X is 10. Oh, 10. Oops, 10, not 11. Hey. Well, if we do that, it's 31, 57, and 31. But let me double check here. 20, and then Z is 21. Okay, so yeah. And there we go. All right, now, to get to the next part, you know, you need to have the this stop on an island. And you trigger a next round, but I've sometimes had it be kind of bugged. Specifically, if you trigger the next round while Peck is talking, it, like, seems to never work. And then, so I like to give it a little bit of time after he stops talking, and then hopefully when I trigger the next round, it's good. Sometimes it's not, and I have to go to round 9. There we go. Or to round 10, I should say. Alright, drop it off here. Oh. There we go. Perfect. On to the next time. Oh, I gotta pick up the resonator. <laughs> oh, I don't want to do that. Don't want to forget that. All right, drop that off here. Yes. Sometimes I feel like it is a little foolish how much I run through things. Oh, shoot, I need ammo. Oh boy. I'm going to go down. I'm going to go down. Please get in here. Yes. Oh my goodness gracious. That was so close. 
grab the resonator, and on to the last island. Now you gotta be a little careful. I have had one of these rounds trying to do this. If it triggers round 10, 10 is gonna be one of those special rounds with the uh, flying ones. It seems to stop the progress and like bug out on this step. Any zombies that spawn in after that will never, it will never do the, uh, where it turns one of them. So you gotta be a little careful. Perfect right next to it. Oh, didn't pick it up. Oh boy. <laughs> Yes! Haha! -ha. Alright, so we're gonna grab this. Head on back and craft the Wonder Weapon. Alright, so we're gonna go ahead and craft this. And then I will need this pack a punched, so I'm a little short, so I'm gonna have to trigger the next round, and then I'm gonna thin out the round until it's one left and continue on. All right, so I'm gonna pack a punch this. Now I need to go around to these traps here and you wanna find the trap with, and would you look at that, the first one I go to. Uh, you wanna find the trap with this key card underneath. And you're gonna turn the trap on and then you're going to use the primary fire on this until a hard drive comes out. Oh, there it is, hard drive. So we're gonna grab that. And we need to take this hard drive to Dr. Peck. All right, so we're gonna give this hard drive to Dr. Peck. Morons, hurry up. We're still up to our eyes and shit out here. He'll do his thing. According to this, you will find Nathan in the laboratory. About time. All right, I'll unlock the observation port in his holding tank. Then he should be able to hear you. Raptor One, we're making progress. I want us off this rock as soon as he's free. Okay, now, for this next part, you can go down and talk to Nathan first in the bio lab, but you're gonna end up needing a code. So we're gonna go collect the code first. So I wanna look at this clock here, and I'm looking at the hour hand, so four. So the first number that we need for the code is four. And then the second number is gonna be over here in the mess hall, and you're looking at this, so seven. And then the last one is gonna be over in engineering, and it is going to be this sign here that says day is since last injured is three. So four, seven, three. All right. So we're here in the bio lab. So we're going to come over here. And if you didn't grab the numbers, you'd first interact with this and you will meet Nathan. See, then they'll say some way to unseal it here, and that's what this code is for. Now, yeah, if you didn't do the digits before, you just go get them now, but 473, we get the unlocked. And if you're with a team, you will all need to interact with these little handles here, but if you're by yourself, just one, obviously just you have to, and it will start this mini boss sequence. And I picked up a Perkaholic, so I'm gonna pop that here. Gumballs, sodas, how long before it's cigarettes? I swear I'll pop a skull for every day this prison goes to me. What the fuck is that thing? And this fight is pretty tough. I have yet to beat it, so let's see if I can get through it this time. I am way better prepared before. I don't even think I had a rare... I don't even think I had a rarity on my weapon. 
I just had Pack-a-Punch. So, I'm much better off this time. Especially now I got all the perks. But there are a lot of these sprinter zombies that spawn, so you do just kind of have to constantly be on the move. Oop, can't aim. The downside is that you do move a little bit faster than Nathan, so sometimes you lose track of him as you're trying to run away. And he is like the other amalgamation, so you gotta be careful. He will reach out his little arm and grab and pull you. And this guy is definitely just a big tank. I'm gonna need ammo here. Next time I pass by one, I'll have to grab it. Ooh, hello. In fact, let's just, oh, perfect, ammo on the ground. But let's just buy up. Nathan, where are you? There you are. Oh, ho, ho, there we go. Save it, Peck. But I need sorry right now. Need to get even. Whatever else we do, we're gonna kill everyone responsible for what they did to Nathan. Got it? Especially that syndicate trash Franco, who sold him to Modi for his sick experiments. I am many things, but sick is not one of them. What the hell? Oh, I've been watching your progress from my sub. Frankly, I'm amazed you're still alive. But let's face it, you are never getting off that island. You are fucking dead, Modi! I don't care how far you run, you'll pay for what you did to Nathan! And for everything you put us through these past six years! And you're giving back my goddamn warheads! <laughs> I don't think so, Dr. Peck. I'm just counting the minutes till you're all torn apart. We are gonna get her. Right? Absolutely. Damn straight. Woohoo! Well, I'll, this is the furthest I've gotten so far. Okay, so the next step is going to be going down in the water, and there should be a key card that spawns somewhere. Oh, here it is. Okay. It's basically right under where he died. All right, so the next step, we need to get out to the shipwreck. And, and actually, I'm going to take note of this. This one I do not need to come to. And you will see after I go to the shipwreck. Okay, so here's the boat. So we're going to go in this center area here. Oh, hello. The network cables could be manually reconnected in theory. And we're going to climb up this ladder here. And with the key card, this door will open. So it was closed. I think you can kind of see it that it will open. We're going to take one of these connectors, which will spawn this little mini area here. Now, if you're with a team, it's probably best to have one person at each uh, of these entrances. But I'm by myself, so I'm just going to have to make do. Ooh. 
All right, so there's one done. Now we need to take this connector, and you can notice it on my back now. We need to take the connector to, there's like some spots along the uh, map that there's those giant cables like I had showed under C Tower, but it's not connected. Now the C Tower one is connected, so there's three spots that this can spawn. Um, and we'll need to do two, if you'll notice there was another canister in there, so th I'll have to do this again. Now if you're with a team, I believe you can do it all at once. You can each take, like, two people can take canister. But, um, let's see, one of them is on Crab Island, the other is under the Sea Tower, where I showed, and then the last one is in the Sea Cave. So for this map, for this instance, it's gonna be Crab Island and Sea Caves. All right, let's see if I can get this done. I hope yep. Still a world out there, you know, with live people. All right, and now I got to do it again. I got to go grab the other connector, and then I will have to go into the sea caves. All right, so we're going to take this other one here. Nice thing is you don't have to go through that little lockdown sequence. Alright, there we go. Oh. My name is Trout. My associates and I need urgent assistance to escape this facility. Trout. Oscar Trout. Are the others with you? What is this? What? Explain yourself. Why do you sound like Agent Maxis? She is mine. Source code. The truth Samantha Maxis sacrificed herself to save your world. Yeah. What? Rest in peace. Do not worry. I do not share. I don't believe she sacrificed herself. It's all a lie. The truth is a lie. Alright, so after placing the canisters, we're going to go back up and talk to Dr. Peck. I instructed Peck and Strauss to assemble this device. Use it to hack the radio buoys in the bay. They will boost my signal enough to reach Modi's cell and override its control. Move your ass, people. Modi could be happy to Japan by now. Alright, so Sam is telling us to go take this and hack some buoys around the place. Let me see what uh, gobble gum I get here. Ooh, I'll take that. Okay, so now out on the water, so yeah, these buoys here, you'll see they're flashing. So we're going to drive on up to this and we're going to use that device, which is going to be a little challenging by myself. Why are you just... What the heck? Alright. Can I hack from down here? Do I have to be in the boat? Oh. Come on. Okay. Maybe this isn't right? Oh, here we go. All right, two minutes to get this done, so drive around to the next ones. All right, let's see if I can just interact from the water. Ah, perfect. Okay, get back in the boat, make it to the... I think there's only one more. All right, got all you. All right, so we got that done now. The last thing we need to do, oh, 
Mission established. Overriding submarine control. Ha! In your fucking face, Modi. Activate apocalypse protocol. Arming self-destruct system. Commencing countdown to thermal nuclear detonation. Oh dear. I'm afraid the entire island will soon be vaporized. Sam, can you deactivate the detonators? No. And you don't have time to reach minimum safe distance. Your only option is to deactivate them manually. Alright. So, yeah, you have to come down to Biolab here, and you need to defuse these guys. There's three of them. There's two below and one up top. I feel like this is going to be pretty challenging as a solo here. Oh, boy. Oh, boy. I'm going down. Oh. All right. So, I'm going to have to try and clear this up, but I feel like it's an infinite spawn. Oh, boy. Let's see if that one, like, saved the state of the progress. Nope. Oh, okay, it did. Oh, thank goodness. Okay, so I don't have to hold on to the interact. That's good to learn. Okay, let's get up on this. Oh boy. Oh. oh gosh. That was so close. That was foolish of me. Oh. That was a little close. A little too close. Oh boy. Oh boy. Well, that's right. I don't have perkaholic anymore. I lost a bunch of my perks. Perfect. Alright, so there's two downstairs, and then there should be one upstairs, and I haven't really been good about looking at where this third one is. But it is up here. Oh, boy. Oh, here we go. Okay. That's a bummer. I can't turn and look to make sure my tail end is clear. Oh, boy. Oh, boy. Let me use this. I forgot about my field upgrade. Okay, I've got one more shot at this. I gotta just run towards it. This is it. Can he survive? Oh my goodness gracious. <laughs> Oh my gosh. You actually did it. I am directing Dr. Modi's submarine to the docking area. That was about as close as you can get. <laughs> okay, so at this point, we are boss ready. So we've made it to the to the final boss, but I want to get a little bit more prepared. So I'm going to kind of go through some more rounds, get up some more essence and salvage and try to get my perks back and then also upgrade to Pack-a-Punch 3 and then hoping maybe Pack-a-Punch 2 at least, this wonder weapon. Okay, so I think I am pretty geared up here. About as best as I can be. Got this to Pack 2. It's Pack 3, Legendary. We're going to come over here and start the boss fight. Maybe? Hey. Welcome back, Dr. Modi. We'll be taking that submarine now. Back! You're an idiot! And these thugs of yours are less than idiots! None of you can begin to appreciate the things I accomplished here! You aren't qualified to bust Oh. No, 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 no! 
Bye bye, Modi. Just pretty. All right, I am pretty nervous about this fight because <laughs> I just feel like this is supposed to be played in teams. All right, where are you at? Just keep moving, keep moving and shooting. That's all I can do. I'm presume, I presume there is no time limit for this, so I feel like I can. Just try and be super cautious. Oh, I don't have enough to buy ammo? Oh, that's going to be a big problem. Oh, alright, got to jump in here. I don't really know where I'm supposed to shoot him this first, this first time. So I'm just doing damage to him. Oh, hello. That looks important. Good ammo. And I have no idea if you're supposed to have the weapon out that you want to get the ammo for. So I hope I haven't been just getting a bunch of ammo for my wonder weapon. Now there's literally nothing happening. Oh, alright, there's the right. Oh wow, that kinda hurt. Oh, oh, oh. Alright, do I have enough? Is it 10,000? Oh, it's 5,000. Okay, so I'm kind of almost there. I want to make sure I have enough to buy. So I'm going to work on a little essence. Okay, there we go. Got the essence. Oh god, is it... feels like his health is recharging. Oh boy. Okay, hold on. I think I got to the next phase here. I'm going to clean up these tentacles that are out here. He's back. Where are you? Oh, hello. Ooh, yes. Alright, now I gotta figure out the new weak spot. I think it's right in his mouth. That looks pretty glowy. Oh, oh, I did not mean to go in the water. Oh, 
Oh, I, I keep like not focusing on him. All right, here we go. Ooh, okay, hold on. Now his arms are glowing. I guess it really, <laughs> turning off the uh, hit marker indicators makes it a little challenging to figure out where if you are actually in fact hitting the um, the critical spots on these bosses. I mean, I preferably like it just because uh, I make my thumbnails usually just from my gameplay, so it's makes it one less thing I have to worry about editing. But it makes it a little challenging for. Uh, Figuring out where to shoot. Oh, oh. oh boy, I'm getting brained on here. Got it. Aha, okay, one arm down. Oh, I don't want you to swipe me. Oh, all right. I think that's the second arm. Oh, all right. Your shoulders are back. Let's just kind of run through this little horde here. All right. What shoulder you got? It was your right last time. Don't see it. All right. His health bar's gone now, so he's... I think transitioning to the next phase. What will he look like when he comes back? Like something we must kill. So far, I'm doing fairly good, actually. I'm actually kind of surprised. Hope you left your body in science, because that's all you have left. Oh, I didn't want to go in the water. <laughs> All right, boss is back. What do we got here? Ooh, max ammo. Oh, that would have been nice. Oh, what is hitting me? Oh my gosh. Oh, 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 oh. Oh, that doesn't look good. doesn't seem like a safe spot. I mean, it's like safe, but not safe at the same time. I don't know. It's really weird. Oh, gosh. Oh, I need to get out of here because of that am amalgamation. Get out of here. Surprisingly well. Which, by the way, this beam thing, I thought it was going to, like, kill enemies. It just seems like it just makes them, like, invisible so, like, you can run through them. It's kind of weird. Oh. Oh, where am I going? What am I doing? Uh, get safety, get to safety. Oh, thank goodness. Oh, no, 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 that's a mistake. That's a mistake. Oh, and he's got me. What the heck? Oh, my gosh. Oh, my gosh. Oh, my gosh. What the heck? Oh, boy. Oh, that hurt. Oh, that's right. I've got... Let me call this in. Oh, my gosh. I did it. 
<laughs> oh, buddy. That looked exhausting. Okay, Sam. Whatever your plan is for bringing back Maxis, it better be good. It is. I have scraped all touch of Janice files classified director's eyes only. Richtofen is obsessed with an ancient relic called the Sentinel Artifact. He believes it has the ability to manipulate a form of protomatter called Prima Materia. You can't be serious. That term comes straight from medieval alchemy. <laughs> Don't ask me to believe such horseshit. I am a man of science. As is Director Richtofen, Dr. Strauss. The artifact is believed to be somewhere in the Principality of Avalon. He hired a criminal organization, the French Syndicate, to find it. They are interrogating a man called Gabriel Kraft. Your former associate, Sergei Razanov, now employed by the Syndicate, abducted orders of his boss, Franco. I'm in. Enjoy your revenge, young lady. I'm not chasing after an old wives' tale. Oscar, we've all seen things that seemed impossible. And Richterfin is no fool. If he and Sam believe that this artifact can actually bring her back, we have to try. We can't give up on her. She never gave up on us. She's right. Let's see for ourselves if this sentinel thing is the real deal. Agreed. But I still want to know where that bastard Richtofen is hiding. Unknown. He may be en route to Avalon to collect the artifact. Then let's find it before he does. Heads up, people! Helo's ready! But the storm's getting worse! We gotta go! Now! All right, so there we have it. That is completing the main Easter egg quest for Terminus Island. And I thought that was a lot of fun. The steps leading up to the Easter egg was really cool, or the, the boss fight. That was a lot of fun. I did feel like the prep work that I put in to make it to the um, boss fight, so getting my gun pack-a-punched and all that, I felt like that was a little bit more challenging than the boss fight itself. So I guess I thought going into that fight, I think I was around like, round 26 i thought these zombies within that play area were going to be as strong as the round 26 zombies but it feels like they brought the difficulty down for them so that made it a little bit easier who knows maybe it's also because i was solo maybe they bumped it down i don't know how they handle that between a solo versus a squad playing but overall that was a lot of fun i enjoyed it I'm excited now to start working towards Liberty Falls, getting the Wonder Weapon there, and then also completing the Easter Egg. But this was Terminus Island, so I hope everyone enjoyed the video, and until the next one, peace.